do you do when you have no or low flow in your bathroom faucet? Look at that, it's just a trinkle. Never mind trying to wash your hands, this is barely enough to even brush your teeth. I'm thinking the problem may be the aerator. These are pretty easy to replace, you can do it yourself at home. This was only $5.14 from Walmart, fits most faucets. Chrome blends right in with this one. All right, now it's time to take the old aerator off. Gonna use these old rusty pliers. But I'm not gonna go right at it with the pliers because it's chrome, don't wanna scratch it, and I wanna get a better grip. So I'm gonna use this towel, put it around it like that, make it nice and snug. You guys know the drill, lefty loosey, righty tighty. few turns with the pliers, now I can just take it off with my finger. Oh, there it is, whoa! Think I see the problem guys, you're not gonna believe all this grime. Look at that, it's so dirty. Whoa! Yeah, already we got higher flow. Look at that, all caked on to the top. Coming off, get out of there. Get out of there. But we're not gonna use this one again anyway, just gonna throw it out. These are cheap, like I said, $5 and change from Walmart. Gonna use a brand new one. Here we go, unboxing the brand new one. And look at how nice and shiny this looks. Oh yeah, brand spanking new, look at that. Read the directions here. Got two sets of directions, one for inside faucet threads, the other for outside faucet threads. This one here, we have the outside faucet threads. So it says the thick washer is not needed. We'll get rid of that. This is all we need. Just gonna try to screw it on by hand. First, I'm gonna try to get some of that gunk out of there. Oh yeah, still some grime deep in the faucet. Try to flush it out a little bit. Don't need this same problem happening again anytime soon anyway. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys, again, importantly, no tools needed right up my alley. If I can do it, then anybody can. And that was the easy part. I'm just gonna screw this bad boy in. Just gotta get it right. Come on, catch those threads. There we go, it took me a minute to get it lined up. Just gonna do it finger tight here. And now, the moment we've all been waiting for, what's it gonna look like? Is the flow gonna improve? Oh yeah. Just like new, baby, just like new. No more taking 20 minutes to brush my teeth because we got a little trinkle coming down here. So guys, if you're having this same problem, don't go replacing your whole faucet. We got a recession coming. We got to be frugal with money. Save our pennies here. Go out and buy this peerless, low flow faucet aerator from Walmart. Only $5 and change. Pretty good product. And it looks nice too. Works like a charm. Guys, have you installed the peerless, low flow aerator from Walmart. What's your experience been? Has it worked for you? Have you had good luck with it? Is there something better on the market that I don't even know about? Leave it in the comment section down below. You have suggestions for this channel? What should I do next? Let me know. I'll make the video, put it up here on YouTube for all to see. And guys, if you really like this video, please subscribe. That's what keeps me going and I'd appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Until next time, I'm guys, Jonathan Brown Menzies coming at you with the Peerless Low Flow Faucet Aerator. It's most faucets made of chrome, bought it at Walmart. Jonathan Brown Menzies, signing off.